I do not understand. Does Arasaka not have enough of its own people? Look around, sir. Things are heating up in the city. Zoot, He's no, got one... the gift of the gab. Can't be denied, but I need to steal your buddy for a sec. What are you? Goro, good to see you. As it is to see you, V. I acquired Sorry, some information of my own. Do you know who most wished to honor Arasaka-sama with the parade? His murderer. The irony makes me sick. It was probably his plan all along. Uh, maybe not. What's in it for your Nobu? Doesn't seem like the kind who'd care to honor tradition. That is so. Japanese heritage is one element. Yorinobu will also put on a display of power. The floats are sure to be beautiful, but the wise and I will see in them a hidden message to his foes. What message that be? I am here, Gumindomo. Watch your backs. Not one for subtlety, is he? Still don't see how this gets us anywhere. I have had an idea. Look to the sky. Bridges. The dash floats will pass precisely this way. If I could just get onto Hanako-sama's float, I could speak with her in private. Get there how? Why jump? Of course. <laughs> you are not shit crazy. In front of a crowd? What about security? Or you need not to worry. While you are occupied with your shady dealings, I learned more about the floats. They are all kept in one place, Arasaka Industrial Park. It is there that they prepare them. We need only to break into the compound, find the right float and inject a virus into its system. You will then be able to disable any security before I sneak inside. That sounds hard as fuck, but... Lots of ways to skin this particular cat, you know. Gonna need... I know what you need. It is taken care of. I have an infected shard. It was not cheap, but the man who sold it to me guaranteed it will work. Where'd you get this shard? Across the canal. Kabuki. Hmm. Might actually be half-decent soft then. And if it isn't... Got a few tricks up my sleeve, too. This is good to know. Let us move on. The world calls for great leaders, and the Arasaka Corporation is. To take control of the float is one thing, but not all. The security concerns me. The snipers especially. I will be an easy target. But I may have an answer. Okada-san mentioned the city cameras. If we gain access to them, we will see exactly where the snipers are. You can deal with them as I advance. Looks like Jason. Looks exactly like Jason. B? Sounds like a plan. You agree just like that? The risks are considerable. Yeah, well, get more and more used to that. And now, what would you say to a small test? We must try the shot. The camera control room is in front of us. You must get inside and infect the network. That is all. Uh-huh. And in the meantime, you'll do what? Crack open a can of suds? I will not touch alcohol. At work. I will watch your back. Now, get to it. Hmm. V? Alright. Oh. Can't do that. We're, we're done. 
Ah. More than one way to skin this cat. the door. Alright. Fucking worked. That was it? Seemed awfully easy. And Done. Systems ours. I'm not a thief. The shard works. Good. The easy work we have done. To break into Arasaka Industrial Park will not be such a bed of roses. But before we discuss that... Sit. I have not eaten since yesterday. Give me the best on the menu. I highly recommend the uh, yakitori today. Anything that isn't local, please. See you tomorrow. Joy. I can't believe I'm saying this, but this Saka scum might actually prove useful. He's a well-trained dog. Needs orders, that's all. And when he outlives his purpose, we'll flatline him. No. What the fuck? Chill, Johnny. He's Sokka scum to you. I know that, but Goro's not a bad guy. Not a bad guy. He was Saburo fucking Arasaka's bodyguard. <laughs> Think his pretty eyes landed in that gig? Yeah. Good point. What is this? Hey, Yakitori. Okay, I have laid the plan. One, we break into Arasaka Industrial Park. One and a half, we hack Hanako-sama's float. Two, during the parade, with my help, you eliminate any snipers. Three, I get onto the float. Four, I convince Hanako-sama of the truth. Oh, this is your zest. There's no time to waste, B. This is your elaborate seppuku ritual? <laughs> what? <laughs> why? As far as I can see, you're trying to get us killed. Really like to know why. The risks are substantial, yes. <laughs> but we have no choice. Hanako-sama is our only chance. You have nothing to lose, as I do. I see it in your eyes. I do, actually. Now. We part. Reconnaissance is required. What are you doing? Don't let him off his leash. Let him stray even a couple of feet. You can say goodbye to his fucking honor. You're a stranger in a strange land. Going with you. Hmm. True. And you with your hands, skills, mind of a thief. I'm not a thief. Agreed. This we will do together. Is ultimately to defend the well being of my Cook! Louder! Employees. Louder! That is why I have decided to double the amount of the flesh. 
President Myers has called this He eliminated the last obstacle between himself and the complete power. And they surrendered it to him. What do we call the murder of my father? Was that not a provocation? Was that not a Arasaka? An empire built to last. Before Yorinobu set fire to it from the inside. All of this began with him. The factions, power struggles, all of this. Ksa. Ksa. Where's Yorinobu's rebellious streak come from? No one knows this. Perhaps soon I shall ask him in person. We know. During one of his birthdays. I think. Uh, his father took him to a room and talked something privately with him. And then he stormed out Be and joined the gangs, Steel Dragons. And. And yeah, something. Something his father told him. Triggered all of this. Got factions inside Arasaka? What are they? There are three Kiji, Hato, and Taka. Keiji longs for stability, the old order. They are united behind Hanako-sama. The liberal wing, Hato, support Michiko-sama, Saburo's granddaughter. I know little about her. And then there is Taka, treacherous dogs who support Yorinobu. Not to mention even smaller factions. Tell me about them some other time. Why'd Saburo tolerate it all? Can't get my head around it. Could have kept his son on a short leash. Arasaka because he's not dead. Strong and disciplined man. The strongest man I have ever known. And yet, at a critical moment, he showed a weakness. Did he? For Yorinobu. For his daughter. Huh? When Yorinobu formed his band of hounds, declared war on his own family. Arasaka-sama could have crushed him with one word. Yet he did not. For he did not wish his daughter to suffer. When Yorinobu returned, his tail between his legs, she persuaded her father to give him a second chance. Do you understand? Hanako-sama saved Yorinobu from the consequences uh, of his deeds. I don't know about that. These guys, they don't sound like the sentimental type. I don't think his father would have just taken pity just for the daughter. There's no time to waste, B. I don't buy that. I don't buy any of that. I also don't buy that a guy that kept himself alive as arguably one of the most... Well, definitely one of the most powerful person, people in the world, persons in the world. I don't buy it that he just let himself get killed like that, just like that. I, I don't buy it. I don't think he's dead. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I don't, I don't believe any of the narrative here. Wait. Think she's complicit in Saburo's murder? I think we are all to blame. We allowed ourselves to be tricked. But we will correct this soon. Will you join me? Sure, why not? Let us go from here. I hope you enjoyed it. Please come again. So dust and plastic. I ate two at once. Holy heck. All right, I'm good.
Sweet, 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 clean speed. Call you back. Come. I have found a good place. As you were saying. To observe. Hey V, haven't heard of any cyber psycho attacks lately. I think it's time we put an end to our little arrangement. Drop them by sometime. We'll catch up in person. Sure. Oh, hold on. Hold up. We must just climb up here. Hold up. Why do you wait? Because there are loot. <laughs> you could have just used that. Now this way. Nice animations. Fortune smiles to us. It seems no one is here today. Oh, uh, don't speak too soon. I would call this a beautiful view of the city, if... If? If there was anything to admire. Hate Night City that much? Hmm, perhaps I'm simply homesick, as you say. Now, you must look for vulnerabilities, weaknesses, while I try to think of a diversion. Arasaka cannot discover our intentions. A bit of sabotage is just what we need to divert their attention. I mean, I hate Night City as much as anyone. And I will fully admit, it's a beautiful city. Visually, of course. You will have the best view on the left. I will try here. This old scope should be good for something. Shall we begin? <laughs> I have to say this. Oh, can you run and grab us a pizza? Take out the food? No, just no. If I had time and ingredients, I would prepare some onigiri with cod or with grilled salmon. He doesn't like the food here. No, even better. With umeboshi plums. Mmm, Arasaka-sama's favorite appetizer. Simple, tasty, and filling. I found him chewing once. Pride on his face. It was a protein bar. Saburo Arasaka with a protein bar. Get out of here. Like a true soldier. Okay, enough. Well, we'll both grow hungry. <laughs> okay, hold on. I can wait. It is not me who is dying. <laughs> Good one. That looks really pretty. Shame. Shame it makes her look really fat. Alright, we got these ugly as hell.
Let's do this. So, we must be aware of the mech. I just saw it, yeah. There's no time to waste, B. Oh, sorry. Antenna. Security hub's liable to be in that building. Perfect for sabotage. <laughs> I love Guru. Footbridge, but it's guarded. We will use it to enter if there's no other way. Transformer by the wall. See it? We should use it to step up. Camouflage turrets by the gate. A last resort. I do not wish to die there. This is not bad. No, I'm not done. Looks like a service tunnel by the road there. It could lead to the warehouses. Got eyes on the comm system. A lot of guards. I could use comms for a diversion. Pipes? Pipes. See them? We could use them to get inside. What am I missing? Trucks drive up regularly. Are we to hijack one? Maybe. Uh, what else? man it says keep scanning oh man I don't want to I don't want to miss anything but I really have no idea what else we're talking about here Anything on the roof? Oh no. The windows? see anything else but it's telling me to keep scanning huh. help me here Takamura what am I missing
What am I missing here? Cars. I mean, if it is this hidden. Then... Maybe it's not important. Or maybe because it is hidden that it's very important. Fuck. I, I don't know. I really don't know. Okay, I think we're done. We're done, right? That's good enough. I think I've seen everything. We have what we came for. So, we going in? Hmm. It is what you said before entering a Kampiki Plaza? I wish to be certain. We have not overlooked anything. We should wait and observe. Agreed. If nothing out of the ordinary happens, then yes, we go in in. Sounds sensible. Better get comfy. <coughs> B. What? We got pizza. No sudden movements. Oh my god. Do you see it? That cat? Fine looking feline. Thought they'd all disappeared from the city. It is the first animal I see in Night City. Except <laughs> cockroaches, of course. First it was birds, then dogs. Cats actually put up a fight longest. Perhaps it is a bacchanico. A bacchanico? What's that? It is a cat spirit. It brings misfortune. Can restore the dead back to life. Knows. Feline ghost. I suppose anything's possible. I've seen some shit. My grandmother knew many, many stories about Kitsune, Kappa, Bakeneko too. Nekomara? Where'd you grow up anyway? I am from the slums of Chiba 11. Once when I was desperate to leave there, I... Ah, bad memories washed away by time. I long only for the simple days of childhood. My childhood, let's see. Racing my bobber for the first time through the hills. No, oh, and uh... First kiss in the middle of a synth cornfield. I remember the chemical stench of the canal, where we boys washed our shirts. Corporate transporters sometimes passed through our slum. Arasaka selecting children, but only the clean ones. Transporters, you say? Armored and armed, Chiba 11 had the most murders in all Japan. It probably still has. What they need kids for? Mm. To be corporate soldiers. When they chose me, I felt I had won the lottery. In the army, I was given everything I lacked before. Discipline, regular meals, and when I proved I was gifted, an education. So how's a corpo rookie go from cleaning latrines to being Saburo Arasaka's bodyguard? The highest grades at the academy, service in the special forces, and Arasaka-sama's unmatched eye for talent. You're not saying Saburo fell for you at first sight. To make the right decisions with imperfect knowledge, 
That is how you become the world's most powerful man. 100 candidates standing at attention. And Arasaka-sama looked into each of our souls and chose the one who would serve him best. Damn. I don't know if he had a choice. Can you even deny that? I don't think you can. And all you had to do in return was kill Saburo's enemies. I sense that you judge me, and yet you have no right to. Unlike you and your friend Mr. Wells, I was not arrogant. I did not take the easy path. Saying you got no dirt on your hands? There are no clean hands, but it is important how they become dirty. So Spill, how'd you sully yours? Arasaka gave me what no one else could. Values I could honor, live for. This was most important. You dirty your hands for money. I in the name of principles. I do it for principles too. What the fuck? Wasn't judging you. And true. You are both the corporations. Their order. Their world. Sure do. In a mindless way. Not mindless. Yet you offer no worthy alternative. Take a look around. It's here. Your corporate world in its glorious splendor. You show me filthy streets as if no other world exists. As if nothing else is possible. You're seriously that naive. What of the millions naive. who work for Arasaka and receive stability, safety... Chiba 11 slum rats? They're there. Scraping scraps out of scop tins. Corpse decided that too. We cannot fix everything at once. That's not fixing, that's making it worse. You already forget what happened at Tom's Diner? People hate corpse more than anything. Can't blame them either. Got some regrets, but... Clipping from Arasaka ain't one of them. Sometimes I wish to become a nomad. To leave this world. Forget everything. Let's go. Let's live together, man. You, me, Judy, Johnny. Never too late to change. What is your expression? One cannot teach an old dog new tricks. I'm the dog here, not you. Do you know what I think? What's that? That day in Compec, we both have lost someone important. And we are not at peace with this, so we seek conflict, argue eagerly. Hmm. Finally starting to make some sense. It is the duty of the living to atone for the dead. Hanako-sama shall aid us in our mission. Or Don't know she'll about make that. sure we die for good. Yeah, I'm with Johnny on this one. Bakaneko Fuck. got sick of us, looks like. It will find its own way. Oh, the, the cat just As follows Johnny. We. That's... That's funny. That's interesting. I think I it that. is time to do something. Hmm? Man, I fucking love that. Just the cat following Johnny. And you're like, wait, did the cat see Johnny or... What the fuck? Just that little hint, like... Probably not, right? Probably not. It was just a coincidence. But still, it's just... I love that. Fucking love that. Oh, fuck. Getting worse. You do not look so bad. Well, I've been worse.
Yeah. He probably did some pretty fucking horrible shit. And I don't believe that his reasons of quote-unquote honor were any better than money. Because that's the end goal at the end of the day for for his his employer. The person he was working for, his, his goal was money. So there's no fucking honor. But, yeah, man, it's hard to say how much of a choice he had in all of that, because, you know, they got him when he was a kid and stuff. Yeah, it's pretty sad. Doesn't wash away his, his it doesn't wash away his blame in, in the evil he did, but you can still realize how sad it is that that kid didn't ha that kid never had a choice the moment they chose that kid i'll he, be he was in done. touch the diversionary action that is mine to do You don't say no to a, to someone like that, right? You can't. Same for Arasaka. The moment they chose him, oh, he couldn't say no, even if he wanted to. <laughs> I love that. I love that. He drives like he drives just like me. Don't walk. Okay, where's the where's the truck? Is that him? I think that's him, isn't it? I might need something from here. Hey, friend. Hey, you friend. Good? I'm good. How about you? Oh, you want me to drive inside? Wrong game. <laughs> I didn't have time to back down. Okay. Wrong gate. Not a... Man, they're not chill at all. <laughs> they didn't even... They're like, wrong gate, you're dead. Uh, they're not gonna let me in. So... 
I love how we look. Big sniper. Let's try to do this without knocking anyone out. I want to do that. Just as a challenge. As a challenge. Just like getting the gold. I think it was ghost rank in Metal Gear Solid 5. You don't leave any clues. people I don't want to take him out I want to see if I can do this completely stealthy stealthily stealthily This might be tricky. Is that guy looking my way or... Yeah, he's looking my way. Huh. Can I hack it from here? Oh. Hello. Oh, I need to go before that sniper moves. I need to distract him. I don't have anything. How the fuck am I going to distract him? Oh, this is bad. Surely there's a better way, right? Okay, let's go down. Okay, the sniper's coming. I gotta fucking move. What is that? Remote deactivation? What is that? What happened? Right, right, right. Uh, this guy. I could distract them. Maybe I should have gone the long way around. Okay. 
fail. We failed. Let's not go that way. Okay, I'm in. Find the largest float. They are going to... from inside. That tech. It could be an ordinary terminal. Gotcha. How's things at your end? Good. I'll reach the control room and make a terrible mess. Very well. I am ready. I love Guru. When you finish, I'll make the system sick. I don't know if I have to get it, go up. I want to deactivate the cameras. Open fire! Mm. Okay. So I gotta wait for that guy to move. I can be fast, I guess. Argo. Now he's taking his time. Enemy caught. It was someone else. It was not the same guy. That makes things trickier. Uh, maybe not. Yeah, I don't even know the guy that caught us. He must have come... I think he came from down there. Now he's there. Okay. Wow, that was close. There we go. Now I need to safely get the fuck out of here. Come 
Come on, let me. No. This is nerve-wracking. I think that guy's looking my way. He is. I need to distract him somehow. Did he hear me opening the door? Was that it? Huh. Is he looking at me? I think he is. Well, we're fucked. Okay, I came here. Okay. Oh, man. Oh, he moved. I'm a ghost. read that.
floats ours to do with as we please. You could fly it to Tokyo if you want. Haha, <laughs> I just may do that. Good work. Now it is my turn. Can you see? Terrible chaos. Even the roof is slowly. Me, the roof. That is your will. There are buildings around, smaller ones. Use them to come down. jump there. I can't. <laughs> Ouch. Come on, V. You gotta help me here. I need you to just grab the ledge. It's not that hard. Come on, V. There we go, girl. There we go. <gasps> it fucking worked. Excellent work, B. Okay, what now? Now we retreat into the shadows and arm ourselves with patience. Hmm. I will contact you before the parade. Until then, try not to get into any more trouble. As if I wasn't in enough already. Awesome. Love that mission. Uh, how, how do I... Is that loot? No. Where am I? Arroyo? Alright, that was pretty cool. Um, oh yeah, let's let's get that. What the fuck? Oh. Oh no. Oh, is that a Terminator reference? It is. Arnold Blake. It is a Terminator reference. I recognize because of the bike and the and the place, of course. And there's even a truck. Yeah, look at that. I fucking love it. Terminator 2 reference. There's the bridge where the, the truck comes down. And the truck's following the bike. <laughs> oh, that's so cool. That's so cool, man. Arnold Blake and Tex. O'Connor, yeah. Jimmy O'Connor. Jimmy. His mother wants us to keep him alive. <laughs> a police uniform in a truck.
Hmm. Awesome, man. That's really cool. And poor Jimmy O'Connor fucking died. Future is doomed. No John O'Connor. Is it John? I don't remember. Oh, I love that. That's so easily missable too. The truck. Consume their honor and replace them, hey. Takemura Koro, 27-7. Love it. I would like to hang out with him. No response? Oh, fuck you too. Let's see. Cool. here stamina reload speed I need to remember that I can shoot grenades out of the air health item. Okay. Hmm. 
yeah, I don't know what to what to put points into anymore. I got everything that I wanted, basically. my other bike. Give me some growl. Heck yeah. Fuck. Oh, you you're fucked. Need to talk? I mean no longer. I have a problem. Got a problem and you're calling me? Thought you rejoined the family. Well, I... Yes, I did. But I thought... I suppose that means you're not willing to come. Am I right? On my way. Phew. Thanks. That's good to hear. Give me a little more intel. What's your grief? Well, it uh, would be better to... Let me guess. Saul, right? You know me well. Mm-hmm. See you soon. Are they still here? No, oh, they're... They're gone. Oh, my bike has things on the on the wheels too. I just noticed. I have glowing wheels. That's so cool. That bike is so cool. Lighting, man. And yes, I know I went the wrong way. I really thought I, I had that clear. Huh? Look at the lighting. That's fantastic. Okay. I'm not built for combat. That is very clear.
Not built for combat. Uh, where's the... Shining armor. My damsel in distress. <laughs> what do you want? I love V. Heard you and Reggie have your differences. <laughs> Care to be more specific? I saw what working together looked like with you two. Sabotage, clapping, murder. She's a fixer. Knew that. But I didn't realize how much she changed. I shouldn't have let you talk me into this. Hmm. How about a smile for me, princess? How about this, huh? At least you haven't blown your brains out. Say that's progress. Progress? You call this progress? Got any plans? I'm not giving up on reporting. Oh, it's your call. That's right. It is my call. Gonna stay here at least? Or what? If I don't, you'll come for me again? Long as the eddies are right, huh? Maybe. Hey, girl. What about you? Do I know you? Hi. Just that I'm truly floored by your dedication. You didn't kill a single cyber psycho. Yep. I know how much easier and simpler it can be to take a life rather than save one. Yep. Really, V, nice work. Some of the cyber psychotic have started therapy. Even if they can't be saved, at least maybe we'll learn more about the disease. Because I refuse to believe it's just some kind of cyberware overload. Yeah. Who knows? Maybe I'll learn enough to write a piece on it. But anyway, the reward is yours. Thanks. About cyberpsychosis? Not really, but thanks again for the help, V. About cyberpsychosis? All right. Psycho killer. Come with me if you want to leave. Uh. So... Shotgun. Shotgun. Revolver. They only have one iconic weapon. That's my pistol. Overwatch.
Ooh, that's iconic. Stinger. Cool. I love that model. I love the details on the edge. Really good. Good stuff. That's it though? Is that the best reward you got for... For me not murdering anyone? Really? That's... Hmm? That's the best, eh? About cyberpsychosis? Not really, but thanks again for the help, V. Well, heck. I'm not sure if... I'm not sure if that was even worth it. I mean, the reward, I guess, is, is just the story, right? You gave these people a second chance. Some of them deserved it more than others, but... The reward is the friends we made along the way. Up. You again. He did it again. We just got back together. Now he's dodging my calls. He's just scared of getting dumped. And so he always does it first. And I'm always the one trying to save the relationship. Ugh, I feel like such a gonk. He's the gonk here, Theo. Not you. Oh my god. You have so much love and empathy to give to people like him. But at what cost? I gotta go now. But thanks for listening to all my bitching. I bet you even Donald Lundy sometimes goes through a whole tub of ice cream and three packets of tissues. <sighs> Brandon, you are the sweetest person I know. I'll see you later. I'll see you later. Hey, Brendan, got any jokes for me today? What do you get when you're fired by a corp? Severed and put in a package! <laughs> Who's that girl you were talking to? Oh, you mean Theo? She's my bestest friend. Gosh, <laughs> she's so nice. Uh oh. And pretty and sensitive. I like talking to her. Definitely way more fun than pumping out caramel lattes. Why do I get the feeling that judging people on how they look and feel is ever so slightly beyond you? Hogwash. If I couldn't analyze people, how would I know whether to recommend a daring dairy instead of a Tiancha? 
You're rogue AI. You said you liked some people more than others. Earlier, you thought of a joke. You're sentient. You've got to be. <laughs> oh, stop it. <laughs> You're making me blush. Which would mean I'm overheating and my circuits are frying. Not fun at all. That's what I thought. Take care, Brendan. I like this. Brendan is fun. That was worth it. That quest was really worth it. All right. Let's see. Oh, right. I gotta do stuff. That looks amazing. That looks way too good. Like, holy crap, man. I don't even care that I crashed. This looks way too good. I love this. Look at that road. <sighs> I can't stop gushing over it because it's literally eye porn. It looks so good. Look at that dark road and then the, the headlights. And the light on the on the bike, and the the signs how they light the road. That's way too good. That is way too good. Oh, I love this song. <laughs> <laughs> 